Hello, I am Fearful Pinata, and what I was doing was stupid. Waiting for all the sand to drain just ends in death. So I have a new plan. That may also end in death, but we'll see. I believe this is the correct tower. Yes. Because that one just leads to the Ember Twin. As previously established. All right. And here it comes. I'm going to have to start boosting down as I run in. Whoa! Okay! Oh. Hang on. I wasn't expecting to see. Ah. Oop. I guess I get a sensor that too. Uh, eight minutes, seven seconds ago, received data from previous cycles. Mass receiving data from probe tracking module. Giant steep memory statue. Timber hearth memory statue. 14 minutes until end of cycle transmission. All right. So there are three lit statues. So someone else is alive. From what I know of these masks. I actually just can't look at these walls. Today we finished the excavation of Ash Twin. Here in this space we carved... We will craft our most ambitious project yet, the Ash Twin Project. Powerful enough to send information back in time. We've also finished relocating all subterranean plants we met while digging. We'll need to keep our eyes on how significantly we alter the environment here. How far we've come since our experiments at the High Energy Lab, I still can hardly believe Raimi's hypothesis was true. Poke just sent the warp core for the final tower to us from the Black Hole Forge. Now Ash Twin can be connected with Giant's Deep, where Kasava is working with Avens to craft the Orbital Probe Cannon, and where Phlox is sculpting the memory statues. Hypothesis. It was not by accident the core of our warp tower was the last to be forged. Hypothesis. The cores could ha have been forged faster if Kasava had interrupted my work less frequently to ask for updates. The important point is we are all connected through Ash Twin now, and also that I'm no longer need needed for mediating your disagreements. I can read, I swear. Our friends on Giant Steep tested the orbital probe cannon today. Mallow tells me the cannon is doing well and that Avens advocates for more launch power. If anyone can coax the maximum power from a device, Avens can. But then, if anyone can goad a device into exploding, that too is likely Avens. Avens? Perhaps I should check in with the orbital probe cannon crew in the interest of safety. Would it help to remind Avens that Mallow, his love, will be one of the Nomai aboard the cannon, or is Mallow part of the problem? Phlox and Daz finished the memory statues today, and they are truly remarkable. When the Ash Twin project succeeds, or in it, the event it fails, the memory statues will activate, allowing us to gather more data b before we shut down the project. Pi and Idea have worked hard on the Sun Station, and it at last is complete. If everything goes as planned, the structure will prompt the Sun's explosion, which will in turn supply the power the Ash Twin project requires. I'm impressed by their mental fortitude. This was the project's most difficult task in more ways than one. We're nearly ready to activate the Ash Twin project. Here's what will happen. First, the Sun Station will receive the order to fire at the Sun, prompting it to explode. Using the energy from the resulting supernova, the Ash Twin project will send the order for the orbital probe cannon to fire back in time by 22 minutes. Exactly 22 minutes after these orders are received, the Sun Station will again trigger the supernova and send the probe data from this cannon launch back in time. In total, each cycle created by the Ash Twin project will last precisely 22 minutes. We can end this cycle at will. 
These words are difficult to write. The sun station did not work. Suppose we redesign the sun station to generate power of that magnitude. A supernova is still our only viable op option. This is easier expressed than accomplished. You can wait for the sun to explode on its natural timeline if you prefer, Idea, but you'll need to find some way to halt our aging process. I believe we can still find a way to create a supernova, my friend. Don't lose hope. However, this is the closest we have ever been. The Ash Twin Project is theoretically sound. We were on only unable to power it. Perhaps there is another way. We are halting our research into creating a supernova for this moment. A comet has newly arrived in the solar system and we're anxious to explore it. It's been a very long time since we last explored somewhere new, so we're excited to welcome this comet. Imagine what knowledge might be gained there. Uh, there are projection stones everywhere. Brittle Hollow? Is this stuff I've already read, I wonder? I have good news, Yarrow. The advanced... I th I'm pretty sure I've read this. I have good news, Yarrow. The advanced warp core is ready to be installed on the central chamber of Ash Twin. I'm intrigued, love. Everyone here is working on the Ash Twin project, is excited to see it. Pi is beside herself with jo joy. No, it isn't. Is everything well at the forge? Dora Love Poke is only nervous. The core is extraordinary and her design work is beautifully clever. Yeah, I've read this. Not that it's bad, but I have read it. Is there a projection? No, it's all for reading. Uh, I'll check all of them. I think I've read, I may have read all of them, though. Is this one going to be about... Oh, the ore, yeah. That's what I thought. And just for the sake of completeness. I've installed the mass inside the Ashtron Project flocks. They look beautiful, although I feel as though I'm being observed. Yeah, I read that one as well. Freaky. Alright, what am I looking at? That. Oh, okay, so that's the center of it all. Artificial gravity control. That's how I got here. Sorry about that. Uh, that's what I'm after. I spent a lot of time reading, though, so I don't know if I have time for this. Cut. Be oh. Jeez. Because if I understand everything correctly, removing this is death. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I might have time. Oh, it all slowed down. Oh, I don't like that. Where's the pad? I need to get out of here now. I need to get to... Um... The place, the Bramble place. The Dark Bramble is actually what it's called. I think I have time. I don't need to freak. I do need to memorize a symbol. A symbol pattern, though. Ash Twin Project. There's more to explore. What do you mean there's more to explore? Did I miss something? There's more to explore. What? I can't halt now. Oh, right, I was gonna look at the... Wait, is that the... Is that the death music playing? Am I about to die? Uh, 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 uh. Ah, man, there's no way I'm gonna memorize that. I'll just stare at it for a second until it's burned into my brain. No way it's about to blow up. I think that's just indicating I'm in the end game. Alright, Dark Bramble. I need that. I assume it'll let me restart the loop as if I didn't disable it, but I don't want to get a bad ending. There we go. And I've been reading, so... I have 
a little longer than 12 minutes. Well, actually, I don't have anywhere near 12 minutes because a lot of my waiting wasn't recorded. Basically, I need to hurry. My window is very short. I went through the wrong hole. That one in the center is a fish. I just need to hug the wall. Well, actually, I just need to boost and let it take me. Nope. Thorns. Stop. I feel like I'm still not going very fast, even though I held that for longer than I normally would. Okay, stop that. That's annoying. Okay, I think I'm safe from the fish. I'm actually not sure if whispering even gets picked up by my mic. Alright, let's go in here. Rotate, halt, go forward, down, just go straight and avoid the spinning crap. Ooh, spicy. Uh, I'm hoping to see the graveyard. didn't see the graveyard. That's not good. I was hoping to use that as a guideline. It's near here somewhere. That's a fish. I'm wasting time. Could just go for it, but uh, I like using my scout as a guide. Mm. Oops. Bring it back. Ah! Stop. Okay. Go. Ooh. Is this supposed to be friggin' terrifying? Because it really is. When I see the eggs, I'll have a rough idea of where to go, but not really. Because I didn't get to fire my scout into the graveyard no uh, bramble node. Pretty sure it's... I'm scared they'll notice if I launch a probe. They aren't close now. Stop. They're not moving. That's a fish. There's a node that way. I hope this is the right one. I think it is. Nope. Leads. It leads into a loop. Crap. 
I'm wasting a lot of time. That's a fish. I feel like I don't have time for any of this now. Maybe I do. Nope, I'm dead. Cool. I'm gonna get a bad ending. And then we get to do this all over again. Anyway, this is what I was trying to do. Because that will actually lead me through the anglerfish nest. You are dead. Me and everyone else. I knew that was right. I don't know why I keep double checking. I'm so paranoid in this place. I want to go through this end. Not that I think it matters. Ooh, okay. Down. That way? Where are you? go down 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 until I see lights that's what I'm after okay all right let's angle try not to hit any of these no my corpses there we go Um, come, I'm, 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 I'm freaking out a little. Ooh, ooh, that's not velocity match. Okay. Come. That's why I couldn't find it. The node, for whatever reason, is it making light? It might. Oh, I think it's behind something. Now that I think about it. Uh, I could put that away. I think 
I can turn around safely. Yeah, the rotational thrusters don't seem to alert them. Wish I knew how long I had. They're fading into darkness. Punch it. Safe. Am I in my suit? Okay. Ooh. Bad. Forgot to account for my body. Okay, we're gonna... I don't trust my memory, like I said, so... Wait. Oh, okay. So I don't have to go by the lines. I did not understand the purpose of this thing when I first found it. What just happened? What is happening? Did I do it? What is that? That's a personal teleport. What if... So... I guess that's what I have to do. The doors are all closed. And the one Nomai I met, Solanum, she said what happened... She asked what happens if someone were to consciously enter the eye. All right, so quantum moon is in fact a reflection of the eye. What am I looking for? I found answers on the quantum moon to the south, so if it's a reflection, then the same should be true for the eye of the universe. I guess? Am I missing something, or can I just walk? What was that? Whoa. I got du trees? A tree. Oh, thanks. Thanks for the oxygen. Uh, what's happening? Just, I'm just gonna keep walking. Nothing bad can happen to me if I keep walking. Big vortex, just like on the quantum moon. 
But this one looks a little different. Connection with scouts is lost. All right, can't use that. Do I want to go down or up? Ow! What if I just died right here? All right. What am I looking for here? Oh, that... Oh, I get it. Then I jump in, right? I'm getting some 2001 A Space Odyssey vibes. What? It's goop. The universe is goop. I knew it. Oh. Found my felt spot. Oh, wait. To explore the source at the end of the universe. The Nova, Nomai never got to see it for themselves, but thanks to their efforts and technology, a Harthian was able to reach the eye of the universe. Nothing. Yeah, no scout. Okay, what's this? At the end of its lifespan, our sun collapsed under its own gravity and then exploded in a violent supernova. Yes. Oh, well. Of all the life forms who will perish in the oncoming death of the universe, we will miss the angler fish the least. Uh, agree? Wait. The Numa who came to our solar system were following a signal from the eye of the universe. We never figured out how they died. Up, I guess. I am in space. I guess go forward? Wait, those are... Whoa. Whoa, that's trippy, that's awesome. There are little galaxies in the forest? Galaxy has seen better days. Wait, what am I doing here? Wait, signal scope. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, they're all fizzling out. gonna be dark in a sec.
Wait, all the trees are gone. No crickets. Oh, quantum. A quantum shard. Um... Breathing? That's me. Whoa. I can't... I can't detect any quantum fluctuations. Oh. Okay. Is there something I need to do here? Connection with Scout is lost. Uh, small. A campfire. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's my shadow. Scared of my own shadow. Oh. Esker. Do you hear music? First person we're finding, Ryback. Okay, where's your door? Do I need to go on top? I'll go on top if I have to. Okay, it doesn't look like I can get in there. It's just a banjo. Oh wait, there it is. Oh, it's all, it decays when I'm not looking. Got it. Oh. This video is gonna be an hour long. though it's um it's not quite time yet i'm pretty sure we'll need the others for this part well we'll need you know everyone no rush take your time it might not even exist here oops that's not my signal scope the quiet shade okay he's really weird to get all right, let's see if I can find Chert then. He's easy. Huh? Wait, I have to memorize where he is? Hold up. I do. He's around there. Oh. Okay, I thought I had to go get him. Let's try that again. Maybe I need to actually examine the telescope before I let it just go away forever. No, doesn't appear to do anything with that. Do I need to actually fly? No? Alright. What's this sound? The oh my. They're pointing up.
They're really aggressive about moving me around. Ugh. Oh. Give me a boost, maybe? Ow. <laughs> All right. Oh. That works. Where are we going? Ah, there we go. Well, wherever we're going, we're getting close to it. here. Hypothesis, everyone must be here before we can begin. Once they arrive, I believe we'll be ready for the next step. I'm glad you remembered me. Alright. Across old bark. This isn't, this is easy, it's just pointing. In the ancient glade. It's always dark. Of course he's in a hammock. Did I get it? I assume so because the lights went out. Yeah, there's another person down there. Hey, time pal. So, you're getting the band back together, huh? Go on, go find the others. I'll be here. You don't need me yet, but you will. I need the travelers for something, then. Chert is going to confuse me, I think. Oh, I just need to zoom in. Never mind. Feldspar. All right, Feldspar, what's the trick to you? That scared me senseless jellyfish didn't bother me but my god all right everyone's here i'll talk to everybody sure shall i begin yes well then here i go should i begin yes you got it! I'll do my best! I can't play with the whole group. Can I start? Yes. Okay, I won't let you down. What do you say then? Should I get up the old harmonica? Here goes nothing. What do you say, time buddy? Ready to start the music? This should be cool. A conscious observer has into the eye. I wonder what happens now. Is it time to find out? Yes. This song is new to me, but I'm honored to be part of it. I think that's everybody. It is.
Do I jump in? Whoa! Did I just witness the Big Bang? Did I just cause the Big Bang? Right. So I took a moment after the credits to sort of process what I just witnessed. Because that ending really hits you with a lot all at once. So early on I had a theory. I say early. Um, I thought maybe the the uh, signal the eye of the universe was giving off was the this song here that's playing the uh song of the traveler travelers plural and that ending actually kind of sort of confirmed that that might be true but if they were hearing a song they would have noticed and solanum probably wouldn't have said the song is new to them then again when they the original Nomai arrived because Solom was raised in the solar system. Uh, they said the song stopped or faded or something. Something happened. Because maybe this system wasn't being the system wasn't being consciously observed. Maybe all points of time existed at once. But once they got their eyes on it, it was their point in time. I don't know. That was clearly the Big Bang, and we reset time, sort of. It looks like, rather than creating a time loop, we may have created a new timeline that maybe won't end in absolute death and destruction. Because bringing everybody together after they were expanded, only for them to suddenly expand again uh, just before I'm stuck in space with a cracked helmet watching the Big Bang doesn't give a lot of room for interpretation on what um, I just did by stepping into the eye. I guess, did I create a Big Bang or did I go back to the Big Bang? Would be a different matter of discussion. But based on the 14.8 billion years later bit, uh, I'd say I may have created a new one. Um, man, this was a wild experience. I've never played a game where your progress is blocked by how much you know. Like, if I go back, I could probably just go straight to the end now because I have the co I have the coordinates and I know how to get the warp core so this game should be a cinch to speed run actually my favorite uh, part even though I it terrified me was probably uh, even though I did it like three times now uh, coasting by those three anglerfish 
at the entrance to the nest. Uh, my favorite because I've never clenched my whole body that hard. Though it's really hard to pick a favorite moment in this game because... I don't know, it's all good. Except for maybe... When I, uh, when I first started playing, before I got off Timber Hearth and really, like, dug into it, I was kind of eh about it. I wasn't sure, but then again, I wasn't sure what I was in for, I guess. There's still stuff I haven't explored. Um, I didn't go to the Anglerfish Cave, for one. I think I've done everything in Dark Bramble worth doing. I didn't look at the... Um, escape pod. Only the Nomai graveyard. Uh, I didn't figure out what the deal is with the interloper. Or why that's a thing I need to worry about. Uh, I found... Uh, well, I did find out Pi... Pi and two others died there. So... Um, I ended up really liking Giant's Deep, even though it scared me. Because, you know, Thalassophobia is great. Though, ironically, the place with the big scary fish that eat you isn't Giant's Deep. It's the other scary place called Dark Bramble. Oh, well. Uh, I think that's all I have in terms of thoughts. I'll need to think about this a little more. So... Thank you all so very much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll talk to you all later. Goodbye.